EXP Realty explained, I can almost guarantee that this video is not only going to come as a surprise, but a number of things that I'm going to talk about are going to shock you because I've watched every video out there about EXP and nobody's talking about this stuff. And what it is are the 10 secret benefits of EXP's model that nobody's explaining. And I'm going to give you some context as to who I am, what I've done at EXP, just so that you know that these are some of the nuances that nobody really explained, but makes a massive difference when you're looking at this incredible life-changing opportunity. I've been with EXP for just over two years at the time of this recording. And at the time of this recording, within those two years, I was able to break the record and still continue to hold the record for the most amount of personally sponsored agents and the most number of personally sponsored actively producing agents globally in the history of the company. And I've done it all without reaching out to a single agent. I've never messaged an agent. I never called them, texted them, emailed them, sent a DM or done an event or anything about EXP. Every single one of these people that have partnered with me have come directly to me because I attract, I don't go out and recruit. So what I'm going to do is I'm I'm going to break down some of the subtleties and nuances of the model that nobody's really talking about and are actually the most important ones. Number one is why agents actually get into real estate. So I've talked to over 1200 agents in the last 12 months, about hundred agents per month. And when I ask people why they get into real estate, they say two things, wealth and lifestyle. And yes, of course there's, I love working with people. I love helping people, things like that. Uh, but besides the point, they want to create wealth. They want to create a lifestyle. Well, let's break that down for a second. Wealth requires four things. Hence the wealth quadrant. You've got duplication, equity ownership, passive or residual income, and multiple streams of income. This is why agents invest into real estate. So the traditional way of creating wealth is to trade enormous amounts of time for active income through commission, then invest your active income into rental properties because when you have a rental portfolio, you have duplication of doors, passive or residual income, multiple streams of income, and equity ownership and properties. Well, the problem is, is that if you wanna double your rental portfolio, you have to go invest the same amount of time into the same amount of active income, close more deals to invest. Well, at eXp, we have all four components of the wealth quadrant. At a traditional brokerage, you have none because you have one income stream that requires your time invested in creating it. So by definition, just by the nature of being at eXp, you can create wealth and at a traditional brokerage, you cannot. Lifestyle requires two things, money freedom, time freedom. You can create money freedom at any brokerage in the world. You cannot create time freedom because if you have one income stream that requires your time invested in creating it, which is commission, and you don't invest your time, you have no income, you have no flexible lifestyle. Whereas now with me, I was a top producer, you can see the awards at my past brokerage for multiple years. And one of the biggest things was that I could never enjoy a vacation because a traditional agent is paying for vacation twice, once for the vacation itself and once for the opportunity cost of missed clients while they're on vacation. And I found, and many of you can probably relate to this, that whenever I was on vacation, I wasn't able to enjoy myself. I was checking every email, I was checking every phone call, worried I was gonna miss a message. Now, if I go on vacation, I can make five figures taking a week off and really enjoy myself and not have to be checking everything because there's 1200 or so employees in the cloud that are supporting the business as well as my business partners at eXp. But long story short, wealth and lifestyle are both created at eXp and they're not created at traditional brokerages. Number two, getting compensated more for doing the exact same thing you would at any other brokerage. Let me unpack this for a second. A lot of people make, again, the misassumption that in order to benefit from eXp, you have to attract or you have to recruit or whatever you wanna talk about in terms of the residual income. Couldn't be further from the truth. Whenever you close a deal at a traditional brokerage, you get commission. Whenever you close a deal at eXp, if you're leveraging the agent equity program, you get commission plus stock ownership in the company. When you cap, you get a bonus. When you close your first transaction, you get a bonus as well. And there's a multitude of other ones. When you're at a traditional brokerage and become a top producer, you get a trophy usually with your name on it. At eXp, if you hit icon status, which is cap plus 20 transactions or 500,000 in GCI with a minimum of 10 transactions, you get your entire $16,000 cap back in company stock which was the first time a company's reimbursed their agents every dollar they paid in form of a split back in the form of ownership for hitting production milestones that otherwise you'd be getting basically nothing for. And talking about the revenue share, let me explain something very important to you. Let's say you're at Remax, for example, and somebody hits you up on Instagram or a friend, family connection, relative, whatever the situation is, and they say, Mike, I just got my real estate license. Where do you think I should go? you're going to say Remax. If they say, Mike, if you're at Coldwell Banker and they say, Mike, just got my real estate license, where should I go? You're going to say Coldwell Banker. I was the 24th agent at my past boutique brokerage, helped a ton of agents join that brokerage because of my personal brand, my content, things like that. And I was best friends with the CEO of that brokerage. I got $0 for doing that. 
I did the exact same thing at eXp, and now last month at a six-figure residual income month after two years. So when you start looking at this, you're doing the exact same thing. You're just getting a whole lot more for doing it. Number three, your family, your loved ones, the ones that mean the most to you. So whenever I talk to agents, I also ask why they get into the business from a personal perspective. And almost every single person, as long as they've got that relationship, says that their family is the most important thing in their life, as is with me, and that they're doing this to provide a better future for their family, and they want to basically give them the life that they've always dreamed of. Well, at eXp, the residual income that you build is willable. So let's say I was at a traditional brokerage and knock on wood, this doesn't happen, uh, but I get in a bad car accident, I pass away tomorrow. I'd leave my family with whatever I've got today. Well, at eXp, if I passed away tomorrow, somebody in my family could get their real estate license and inherit my revenue share, which is basically a seven figure per year residual income to provide for my loved ones for the rest of their life. So when you start looking at this, you have the ability to provide a security blanket to the ones that you say you're doing this for. Whereas you put your family in a very vulnerable situation because of things that have happened that we all know about the world over the last couple of years, a lot of people got into some pretty unfortunate situations health-wise, and sometimes people lost family members and left them with, unfortunately, not too much. And this is a way to, again, provide a security blanket for the ones you love the most. Number four, exit strategy and retirement plan. We all are going to exit the business one day, whether we want to by choice or whether we want to for health or whatever the situation is. But at the end of the day, we're all going to look at eventually having an exit strategy. Unfortunately, many realtors can't look past the next deal or the next year. So they're not really thinking too far, especially if they're younger, but you have to. So let me explain what happens with most agents. And I'll just use an example. Let's say you're 40 years old and you want to close deals to your 50. Well, at a traditional brokerage, you're going to go put 10 years into active income, time away from your family, friends, passions, hobbies, in order to go close as many deals as humanly possible. And then whenever you're 50, you're going to get a handshake and a thank you for making your broker a ton of money. And then your income goes to zero. Well, after 10 years of working your butt off, your income now goes to zero. And also most people as income goes up, so does expenses, so does living costs. And most people don't save enough to actually retire. So let's look at the alternative solution with an incredible brokerage model like this. Let's say you're 40 years old and you want to close deals to your 50, but you're healthy until you're 70, for example, to maintain your real estate license. As long as you maintain your real estate license, you retain your residual income. So from 40 to 50, again, same situation. You'd be working for active income. Then from 50 to 70, you'd be getting 20 more years of monthly direct deposit residual income with younger people below you in your organization that are likely actively building their residual income, which likely means not always can't make any statements or any claims, but that may mean that your monthly residual income increases while you're enjoying your retirement, your exit, time on the beach, time with your grandkids, family, whatever. So now you've got a security blanket for your loved ones and an exit strategy that you would not find in almost any other brokerage. Number five, not being geographically restricted. This is an incredibly important thing for people to understand because a lot of people say that real estate, there's unlimited potential. There's no cap on the amount of income you can make, but there is a cap on the market share and the market size. So that's why you barely see any agents in almost any market, unless you're, you know, New York or LA or Toronto or Vancouver that are making over one to $2 million a year DCI. It's very rare, right? There's you can make that amount, but then again, you don't really see too many people making five or $10 million in GCI a year because they're geographically restricted. And just based on the saturation of those higher price point markets, it's difficult to break past that barrier. Whereas with eXp, it's a global opportunity. You can partner with people from anywhere, any country, state, province, city that eXp is active in. So when you remove geographical restrictions, you can scale your business. So this is why, again, if you look at any strong agent, they have strong connections in other markets. They have a strong personal brand that people in other markets recognize, and they have strategies that other people would like to learn from. But the problem is, is that they don't really want to share in their local market because then they're basically creating competition. With this model, you can share all your best strategies, help people in your organization scale their business outside of your market, and you can leverage your brand to the fullest extent because anybody that does high production or has a strong brand attracts not only clients, but they also attract agents. Number six, creating leverage of your time and your income. Let me explain this, and this is a very important principle. So when you look at maybe doubling your business, right? If you want to double your business, you have to put in usually double the effort, which 
requires a lot more time. But the goal, once you start making money, is you realize that time is the most precious commodity out there. You want to save time because you can make money, but you can't buy time back. So a lot of people, once they start reaching the multiple six figure per year, seven figure per year threshold, they start to put a lot more focus and weight on time versus money. But if you want to double your business, you have to spend twice as much time in most cases, aside from, again, the obvious systems and processes and streamlining things and stuff like that and outsourcing. But in general, you'll have to. Well, for me, if I've got over a thousand agents in my organization, which I do, if I help each of them increase their business by, let's say, a couple of deals per year, one more, two more, three more deals per year, my income could double because it's spread over a thousand people, right? So now you're creating leverage of your time and your income because you're partnering with other people and not all the lifting is on yourself. So this is a really cool opportunity. And again, I've helped a ridiculous amount of agents double, triple, quadruple their production, do upwards of 90 deals in their first year. So I help a ton of people, not just do one or two more deals per year, uh, but do a massive amount of deals per year once they partner with us and they see some of the private um, and secret training tools and resources we have behind the scenes and the five mastermind calls we do live every single week. Number seven, looking at how to actually increase your wealth. And when I talk about that or increase your income, for example, there's three different components to making money. There's the income itself, which you want to increase. There's the time involved, which you want to decrease. And there's the stress involved that you want to decrease as well. So time, money, and stress. When you look at this, this is why, again, two agents could sell a $400,000 property, both exact same property, exact same sale price. One of them made more money. The income is the same but one of them spent less time and had less stress while doing that deal. So when you look at eXp, one of the incredible opportunities is, let's look at, for example, support. There's over a thousand employees in the cloud that are supporting the agents 24 hours a day. So now my time is reduced in terms of supporting other people to help my business keep growing. Same with my sponsorship, right? When I look at my partners that are above me, all of them work very closely with me and help me a lot, especially my business partner, Connor Steinbrook. And we do everything together. And whenever I am you know, on vacation or traveling and speaking somewhere, I can text any of the you know heavy hitters in my group and say, hey, can you run this call for me? Can you do this mastermind? Can you do this? And they can because I've trained all of them to be similar to me in nature and have my skill sets. Leaders create leaders. It's developing talent. That's how you build a scalable business. And most people are only worried about themselves. So this is a really cool opportunity because now it leverages my time, but it also leverages my income because now I don't have to do all the work. I can help a ton of other people scale their business instead of only focusing on scaling my business, which inherently helps them win and helps me win as well. Number eight, we briefly touched on this, but I'll go down a little bit deeper, which is making more than 100% of your commission. There's a lot of agents that say, well, I want to go to a flat fee brokerage. I want to make 100% of your commission. And I will ask them, is that all? All you want to make is 100%? And that catches a lot of people off guard for obvious reasons, uh, but it's true. So at eXp, again, we're on an 80-20 split, $16,000 cap. When you cap, you go to 100% commission, do 20 deals after capping, you become an icon agent, get your $16,000 cap back for free and company stock. Again, just got to meet the requirements, which I won't go into in this video. Uh, but if you want to know more, you can reach out to me and book a call. Either which way, let's say, for example, and I'm not going to make any claims. I'm not going to make any statements. Again, you, the stock can go up, down, diagonal, horizontal. Who knows where the stock's going to go? But in many cases, my partners have gotten their $16,000 cap back. And then that $16,000 turned into $50,000, $100,000, dollars $200,000 over the last couple of years. So now that's more than 100% of commission, which means that you're actually getting more than if you were at a flat fee brokerage with no split and no cap. And that's a pretty cool opportunity for people that are focused on production. Number nine is ownership of your business. We all understand the importance of ownership. This is why we'd rather our buyers to buy than to rent, right? We want people to have ownership and in properties instead of renting a property because of the concept of ownership. Well, at eXp, we're publicly traded on the NASDAQ. In 2020, we were one of the top 10 performing stocks in the world on the NASDAQ. And just by the nature of being an agent here, you get ownership in the fastest growing brokerage in history. Well, at most other brokerages, you're essentially renting your business because you're paying a monthly fee to a brokerage that you don't have ownership in. So agents take pride in being a part of eXp because they're owners in the brokerage, which is why it's referred to as an agent owned, agent grown brokerage. It's majority owned by the agents and it's grown through the agents and their partnerships and connections instead of a broker going out and messaging agents or a broker hiring an actual recruiter to message agents. So having ownership of your business is really important and it's a really powerful concept. Number 10, what not many people talk about, which is when people are looking at the revenue share chart of the XP, they're looking at the seven tiers below them. 
What they're not looking at is the seven tiers above them. And this is really powerful because when you're at a traditional brokerage, typically your training and resources and tools are capped based on the skill sets and time that your broker has to invest into you. If your broker is doing the training, things like that. Well, from what I've seen by talking to an endless amount of brokers, most don't properly know how to do lead generation or care or talk about personal branding, which is way more important than brokerage branding. Um, they don't talk about video marketing. They tell you social media doesn't exist or doesn't work. Um, and they tell you to go leverage your sphere, which most people don't have. So that means that you have to go spend money and time figuring this out yourself elsewhere. Well, at EXP, as long as you join the right revenue share organization, which is why your sponsor is so incredibly important. If you want to talk more and I'll show you what we do behind the scenes and pull the curtains back, you can again, uh, feel free to book a call with me in the description. But if you join the right revenue share organization, you'll have seven people above you that all bring different value to the agents that partner with them. So for me, I give all of my social media training on every single platform to every agent seven tiers deep for free. I give five live mastermind calls, breaking down different aspects of scaling their business, including personal development and mindset, and all kinds of stuff that I won't share on this call um, or on this video for free. I have a private internalized hub that is basically automated every single thing a brokerage struggles with, which is a massive resource for new agents. It's helped top producers get a ton of time back, and it's a huge asset um, with our private internalized Wolfpack hub that I have private and hidden. Um, and we just continue to do one-on-one -on -one support as well, where I help people build out custom business plans, and that's just me. Then you've got my sponsor, Connor, who does a ton of stuff, investing, um, building your residual income, scaling a team, mindset, all kinds of stuff like that. And you go up the ladder and it just gets more and more and more. So now you've got seven layers of value versus one. And this is why we're able to help agents close so many deals because we are getting compensated through the company dollar. And instead of your commission going, part to you, part to the broker, and that part to the broker goes just directly to your broker's pockets. Well, at eXp, because we dropped overhead, reduced expenses by going cloud-based, we can afford to give more back to the agents. So that's why a portion that goes to the company comes back to us for helping you scale your business. So you get all of our training, support, and resources, and you don't have to pay for it. So if you have any other questions, again, feel free to book a meeting with me. We can book a one-on-one -on -one Zoom call like I do with many agents every single day, and we can dive into your business and what this model can do to change your life. Help me 10x my income in 12 months. I went from $300,000 to $3.1 million in 12 months uh, by joining a geographically unrestricted model that allows you to create leverage. So thanks so much for tuning in. As always, please make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video or on a Zoom call.